Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today I have a giant beauty haul. It is going to be a MAC Cosmetics haul. Ta-da! I am so excited about this haul. Um, this is going to be a collective haul because I have been uh, collecting these products over a period of two months now. So I really want to uh, divide this video in two parts. So today's video is going to be about um, the products. I mean, I'm going to show you the products and I'm going to review the products which I have already used. And my next video will actually be essentially the lip swatches and hand swatches of my lip products, whichever I have got. Let me tell you that I have actually collected these products over a period of two months. So I have like a ton of products to share with you guys. And the reason why I am putting this up is because I have actually um, taken a lot of effort to constantly keep uh, searching about the products which I might need and then I uh, like keep going to the store and swatch them and try them on and find out what is nice and what is not. So I really uh, want to share these things with you guys so that you have an idea about what is hot or what is not at the MAC Cosmetics. I have a ton of lip products over here with me to share with you guys, a lot of foundations and compacts too. I also picked out a few uh, eye pigments. Also, um, I will be dividing this video into two parts because I have used some of the products before, I mean uh, in while these two months. So that is why I will be reviewing them right now in this video and the rest of the products which I haven't actually used yet, I will be um, swatching them and um, giving you the reviews about it in the second video. So with the longest introduction ever, let's get started. So the first thing I will be talking about is one of my favorites. It is the Natural Radiance. It's basically a primer and it is from the Prep and Prime range from MAC. Mine is in the shade uh, Radiant Yellow. I think the other one is in uh, Pink Pearl or something with pink because that's for more fairer shades. But uh, Radiant Yellow is basically for um, mid-tone, for people with deeper skin tones. So this is basically a primer for brightening your face, for brightening a dull, tired looking face. It has a very nice silky smooth texture. It's basically gel form. Uh, I really love this for the very simple fact that the moment you put this on, it, it gives your face such a nice and beautiful radiance. Um, I think it makes the foundation come on easier as in it's easy for me to put the foundation and blend it out easily so I think that's a really good thing. I am always in for products which makes and increases the efficiency of other products so that's like a really good thing. Now I will be talking about my favorite foundation of all time. Uh, it is the MAC Studio Waterweight Foundation. It also has SPF. One of the biggest, I think, advantages or positive points about this foundation is that it comes with a dropper kind of a applicator. So you can just easily squeeze out the amount which is appropriate for you or uh, which you actually want and it's a very mess free application. You don't have to use your hands or anything to spread it on your face. That's like a very good thing. Also. It has such a weightless feel to it. You don't feel like you have any sort of uh, layer of makeup on your face. It has a very nice weightless formula. Um, also, it very softly blurs all your pores and lines and wrinkles if you have any. It's giving you sheer to medium coverage which is actually buildable. So if you actually want, you can go from like a very sheer everyday coverage to a very medium or maybe more than that coverage which might, you might need for like a night look or for something more special or some special occasion or party. So that's an amazing thing about this thing it's really very hydrating so if you have dry skin you have dry patches it is really really great for you because it has this very nice hydrating formula it really hydrates your skin very very nicely the next foundation I will be talking about is the match master from Mac it has SPF 15 um, I must say I don't think there are many products in MAC which are dermatologist tested but this one is. The best part about this uh, foundation is that it actually adjusts itself according to your skin tone. So it won't make you look chalky, it won't make you look ashy but that does not mean that you can just take you know a lighter shade than what you are so you can't do that. So if you take the shade which is actually correct for you, you can really make this work really very well. It is really very long wearing. I think the longest claim is 16 hours so that's like a lot. You don't have to really powder it a lot because this is demi matte finish. So it's going to give you a very matte finish and very matte look. 
it's going to control oil of course because it's matte finish it really helps to minimize the appearance of pores and lines and wrinkles if you have any it also absorbs the excess oil which is actually there on your face so i think it's like an all-in-one product also i am shade number two in this one um i got shade number three which i thought was good for me but that was making me look a bit darker than my actual skin tone so i actually then went and bought shade number two now i will be talking about the mac studio tech foundation it comes in a container which is almost similar to the uh, mac studio fix uh, powder foundation containers so the texture of this kind of foundation actually ranges um between creamy and moussey kind of a texture so i haven't actually used it yet on my skin so i can't give you like an honest review about it but i really think um okay so it gives a very powdery finish which is quite surprising because uh, this is a creamy product and a moussey product but it's giving like a powdery finish so this is really nice i really don't think i'll have to you know touch it up a lot during the day or during the time when i'm actually wearing this so i think i'll get back with the review to you again but right now i think when i have swatched it on my hand it's nice it's moisturizing and i think it's hydrating the next thing which i'm talking about is something which i have used a lot and currently i'm on the second one it is the max studio fix uh, powder plus foundation the reason why i love this so much is because this is like a one step foundation so it comes in this powdery uh, form and you just have to apply this and it does the work of your uh, foundation. It's going to cover up your uh, imperfections and smooth out your lines and wrinkles and it's going to make your pores like literally disappear. I love this product so much because A, it's really good for combination skin because I know um i don't need to powder it all the time because this is a powder foundation it is going to control the production of oil all the time and and actually if you are putting the radiant uh, illuminator be beneath this it becomes even more easier to glide this on on top of that it also comes with like a very nice sponge so i really like this thing so this is nc35 and this is absolutely perfect for me it's a bit lighter but i think it's perfect when i'm really uh, not into putting foundation i just want to put my primer and then i put this makes me look so radiant so nice and so perfect all in one easy step now i will be talking about the select sheer pressed powder from mac it's like this translucent powder uh, it's so nice it does not actually changes the color of your makeup it does not look ashy or chalky at all it is so lightweight and so easily blendable it does not look like you have a layer of powder or something like that on you can actually touch up your makeup so many times with this but you will still not look very you know chalky or ashy and it won't change the color of your foundation at all the best part about this is that it will actually absorb all the excess oil from your face but then your glow will actually not die. I'm just left with uh, two more products and then we'll be done with all the face products which I have got. So now with what I have to share with you guys are these amazing pigments from MAC. I must say with pigments MAC is really at the top of its game. It's so nice. These are loose colors and they are so highly pigmented the color payoff is so nice you can actually go from like a subtle look to an intense effect with the same product and you don't need a lot of product at one go if you want like a subtle go just a touch of this much is enough i don't know if you can see it and even this much will blend so much and so nicely you can like create a lot of effects i don't know if this color is showing off this is in the shade tan but I love this. This is what I'm actually wearing uh, on my eyelids today. I love this color a lot. This is a very, very sweet rose gold color. And you actually get 4.5 grams for just 18.50 bucks. It's really very long lasting. It won't kick up on your face. It won't streak or anything like that. You can apply it with your hands or with your brush. It does not matter. It's going to come off so nicely and so easily. It's, it's an amazing thing. And also I have two shades. I think one is vanilla. And I took this shade because I thought that I can use this as a highlighter because it's such an easily blendable product. You don't really have to, you know, um, care about or think about or worry about it getting chalked up or looking ashy. So it's a very nice, pretty white silverish kind of a color. It has a very little bit hint of gold in it too. So these 
these were basically all the products which I got not all these are all the face products which I got from Mac rest all are lip products so I got like a lot of lipsticks matte ones creme sheen satin so that will be included in my next video which I make uh, essentially I don't know if I'll be making that video today or tomorrow but I will soon be making that video so that will be basically a lip and hand swatch video of all the lip products which I have got from MAC I hope you guys like this video I hope this was helpful for you I'll see you in my next video for sure bye